Grandview Medical Center held a dedication ceremony and ribbon cutting for a $40 million expansion of the facility's West Wing. This is a very special day for us and for our community. We're absolutely delighted that so many of you have joined us to celebrate this dedication and ribbon cutting of the West Wing edition. Top quality patient care is not a phrase that we like to use in this speech, but we really mean it. And we can back it up. Grandview and Southview are ranked as U.S. News and World Report's best regional hospitals this year. Health Grades has named Grandview and Southview one of America's 50 best hospitals for 2013 and the previous four years. Health Grades also recognized us with the Distinguished Hospital Award for Clinical Excellence this year and the past nine years for 10 years in a row. But it does not compare to the simple thank you from a patient or a patient's family that our staff so much appreciates for a job well done. As I walked up the road and I looked at the facade of this building, I just went, wow, isn't it beautiful? I mean, you can see it better from here than you can from the street, but it's absolutely beautiful. And I just want to say, you know, it took years and years and years of planning, and I know that, but, but this coupled with the great Miami Valley Boulevard, or the Miami Boulevard just down the street, ma makes a big change in the face of this city. And I just, want to, I just want to reassure you that in the last several years, there have been some major changes in Dayton, and we are moving forward faster than I, don't, than I think anyone ever expected. And, and, and we're creating this renaissance, and it has momentum. And I just want to assure you that that momentum will continue because it's people like you coming forward with projects like this that make a difference. This is noticed not just by us, but it's noticed by the neighborhoods, and then once the neighbors notice, they make a difference. And then the people from the suburbs coming here see it, and that makes a difference. And you heard all the awards. That makes national attention. And, and that's, that's really w where we're going with Dayton. It, it is, we're being recognized nationally as a city of innovation and change and renaissance again. And I just want to thank the partners that made this happen. I want to thank all of you that made this happen. And uh, again, thank you for coming out and enjoy the rest of the day with us. Thank you. I'm Dayton City Commissioner Nan Whaley, and I want to welcome you to my neighborhood. I live about three blocks that way, not on Squirrel, but on Roe Avenue, and walk around uh, Grandview just about every day on my morning walks. And as a neighbor, this investment is super important and, con and connects the neighborhood of Five Oaks with the ODOT 75 reconstruction and the new Great Miami Boulevard. And I would be remiss if I didn't uh, mentioned Mr. John Gower, who's in the back, who was key in the Great Miami Boulevard redesign. And a lot of the folks in ODOT didn't really know what we were trying to do there, but really are really doing a, a connection job here from the Dayton Art Institute to Grandview up into the northwest side of Dayton. So wanted to thank John Gower for his work and vision in that. And as a city, we can certainly build the roads and create the parks and create the the infrastructure, but without the work of business, uh, we can't really create neighborhoods and asset-based development like we have here. And when I was first elected, I remember I came to the emergency room opening with Roy and uh, Frank Perez and was really excited that someone had decided to invest in my community and create an emergency room, which I've had to partake in a time or two. And I'm so grateful of the continuous improvement that the new leadership continues to do with with Richard and, and Fred. It, it means a lot to our community that we're, you're investing in the inner city of Dayton. And we also recognize the Grandview Kettering Health Network is a regional asset, and it connects other important places around our region. So every day, a new person is coming into our neighborhood and seeing some place they might not have recognized before. So on behalf of the commission and my neighbors, who are super, super excited about this, we just want to say thank you, welcome to the neighborhood, and have a great day. expansion added a new area for endoscopic examinations, a new surgery preparation and recovery area, a beautiful new cafeteria, as well as a revamped front entrance. 